guys, Smith Boy here. Now today we're back with a brand new video. It's a Rotherham home game. It feels like we haven't had a home game in some time, but today we've got Norwich at home. Last time out for the Millers, it went right down to the wire versus Burnley. We lost, they scored the winner in about the 100th minute, which was absolutely, it was so heartbreaking to watch because we actually played so well that game. Last time out for our opposition today, they got a goalless draw against QPR. Hopefully the defeat from Wednesday night doesn't impact this game in a negative way because like I've already mentioned, we actually played really well. The players should be really proud of themselves. Going into the Norwich game, we were without Bramall. He got sent off in the Burley game. We're actually filming this the night before because I'm feeling optimistic. I actually think we're going to draw 1-1, which I'd thoroughly take. That'd be an incredible result for the Millers. I'm not too sure who's going to score yet. It's the night before. The team lineups haven't come out. Hopefully, he puts a decent side out. I know we've got a few injuries, so hopefully it doesn't impact the team too much. Like and subscribe. That'd be much appreciated. Up the Millers. Come on. Don't score for us. I think it's going to be Richard Moore. Oh, great chance for Norris here. He's off. Oh my goodness. It's offside anyway. But what a miss that was. That has to be one of the worst offside misses I've seen. Norwich make it 1 0. <laughs> 17 minutes played, it's 1 0 to Norwich, we did get the ball clear and it was a header at the back post. Not ideal. When you get when you allow ability like that it's space in box and it's about to happen, isn't it? It's played well though. Get us out! That's something I've not seen in a long time. Conor Washington come off injured, replaced by Georgia Kelly. He's been on literally two minutes and he's already come off injured. Ogbeni is now on, he's up front. Hopefully he can rattle the defenders, hopefully he can do a job. It's about to be half time any moment. To be honest, I think he played quite well in the first half. The referee's not been the best, but obviously can't really blame everything on the referee. We've had a couple of chances, just not managed to take them yet. Hopefully more chances come in the second half. And we actually managed to do something with them and pretty much go from there. School prediction is still on the cards, 1-1. One, one. I'd still obviously take that, but if we can push on for a winner, that'd be absolutely unbelievable. Hopefully, Chiang Benny is the man to do the job. <laughs> Place coming out now for the second half. Hopefully, Ben Wales is changing boots because he keeps slipping in that first half. Black mentioned already, we have the chances. Coming thick and fast, hopefully we manage to take one in the second half. Score picture, like I already said, it's one of one. Joe Benes, come on, he's got to do the job. It will be absolute scenes.
so very much to do with I told you the chances were coming. Finally taken one. Edge of the box. What a finish that was. Bottom right corner. Inch perfect. <laughs> Well, Morris have gone down right at the other end after we've scored, made it 2-1. It was winding that away and to be fair, absolute carnage. Shocking defending though, good save from your answer, but no defenders followed up with the Norwich attackers and they've made it 2-1. seems to have stepped up a little bit. We've got a free kick though, there's in the box. Dan Barlasser is going to whip it in. Look, Sapirlo. Come on. Ah. Oh. Agbede trying to light the spot.